A very, very warm welcome to you all this morning. It's lovely to be together again as we come together today to celebrate Christ the King and the next Sunday before Advent. And of course, next week we also have uh, the American holiday of Thanksgiving, uh, which is such an important time for families and particularly at this time. I do hope you enjoy the service. We meet in the name of the Father, and of the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, and of the Holy Spirit of God. Amen. Almighty God, to you all hearts are open, all desires known, and from you no secrets are hidden. Cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, we come together this morning to lift you up, Christ our King. Amen. The first reading is taken from the book of the prophet Ezekiel. Thus says the Lord God, I will search for my sheep and will seek them out. A shepherd seeks out their flocks when they are among the scattered sheep. So I will seek out my sheep. I will rescue them from all the places to which they have been scattered on a day of clouds and thick darkness. I will bring them out from the peoples and gather them from the countries and I will bring them into their own land. And I will feed them on the mountains of Israel by the watercourses and in all the inhabited parts of the land. I will feed them with good pasture, and the mountain heights of Israel shall be their pasture. They shall lie down in good grazing land, and they shall feed on rich pasture on the mountains of Israel. I myself will be the shepherd of the sheep. I will make them lie down, says the Lord God. I will seek the lost. I will bring back the strayed. I will bind up the injured, and I will strengthen the weak. But the fat and the strong I will destroy. I will feed them with justice. Therefore, thus says the Lord God to them, I myself will judge between the fat and the lean sheep, because you pushed with the flank and shoulder and butted all the weak animals with your horns until you scattered them far and wide. But I will save my flock, and they shall no longer be ravaged, and I will judge between sheep and sheep, and will set over them one shepherd, my servant David, And he shall feed them and be their shepherd. And I, the Lord, will be their God. And my servant David shall be prince among them. I, the Lord, have spoken. This is the word of the Lord. Hear the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to Matthew. Glory be to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, When the Son of Man comes in his glory and all the angels with him, then he will sit on the throne of his glory. All the nations will be gathered before him, and he will separate people one from another, as a shepherd separates the sheep from the goats. And he will put the sheep at his right hand and the goats at the left. Then the king will say to those at his right hand, Come, you that are blessed by my Father, inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. For I was hungry, and you gave me food. I was thirsty, and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger, and you welcomed me. I was naked, and you gave me clothing. I was sick, and you took care of me. I was in prison, and you visited me. Then the righteous will answer him, Lord, when was it that we saw you hungry and gave you food, or thirsty and gave you something to drink? And when was it that we saw you a stranger and welcomed you, or naked and gave you clothing? And when was it that we saw you sick or in prison and visited you? And the king will answer them, Truly I tell you, just as you did it to one of the least of these who were members of my family, you did it to me. Then he will say to those at his left hand, You that are accursed, depart from me into the eternal fire prepared for the devil and his angels. 
For I was hungry, and you gave me no food. I was thirsty, and you gave me nothing to drink. I was a stranger, and you did not welcome me. Naked, and you did not give me clothing. Sick and in prison, and you did not visit me. Then they also will answer, Lord, when was it that we saw you hungry or thirsty or stranger or naked or sick or in prison and did not take care of you? Then he will answer them, Truly I tell you, just as you did not do it to one of the least of these, you did not do it to me. And these will go away into eternal punishment, but the righteous into eternal life. This is the Gospel of Christ. Praise be to you, Lord Jesus Christ.